Welcome to the Microsoft Copilot for Students tutorial. I'll guide you through how you can enhance your productivity, creativity, and boost your career readiness using Microsoft Copilot advanced capabilities. For this tutorial, we will go through a whole end-to-end -end scenario that is very relatable to students. Let's imagine that you are a student working hard and smart towards your dream job and you want to use generative AI to create a comprehensive, personalized, and practical roadmap. To achieve this, we will use Microsoft Copilot to research your dream job and get the most up-to-date information about it, generate a resume for a top candidate for the job, we'll talk more about this in a sec, then create a personalized roadmap that will help you acquire the necessary skills. Part two of this scenario will involve using Microsoft Copilot to create your personal elevator pitch and help you prepare for an interview. Let's dive in. Head over to copilot.microsoft.com, sign in with your school account, and if you don't have one, you can sign in using your Microsoft account. Before anything, you want to ensure that Copilot is tuned to give you the best responses and in the format that you prefer. For this, we'll utilize role setting technique and a sample prompt has been provided for you in the tutorial. Paste in the prompt, which gives Copilot a role to assume. And in this case, it will assume the role of a career coach. We also pass in additional instructions on how Copilot should draft its introduction and prompt the user using relevant follow-up questions. I don't know about you, but with this introduction, I think Microsoft Copilot is now ready to get to work. At this point, you need to have identified a career or role that you want to work towards. We'll focus on the role of a cloud solutions architect or CSA for short. And hey, if you don't have the slightest clue about the role, the next step is to conduct some research about it, so don't worry too much about that. Use the provided prompt and modify accordingly with your career of interest. Here, you will do some high-level research to understand the roles and responsibilities of a CSA. I mean, before you make a career decision, it's quite important to have the most accurate information about what that career is all about. Something I love about this tool is that it goes a step further to surface aspects that you may not be thinking about already. For example, at this point, Copilot knows that you're trying to learn all you can about this role, so it proposes some useful follow-up questions like the recommended certifications, which are contextually relevant for you to broaden your research. You can choose to explore further through these suggestions, but for now, Let's continue with the tutorial. Having an understanding of the role is one thing, and knowing what it would take to qualify for it is another. You could easily ask for this in a bullet list, but let's go for a more visual approach. What do you think about using a top candidate's resume as a compass to guide and help you stay on track when you prepare for your career? I think this approach would make it easier to visualize yourself in that dream job seeing the kind of work you'd be doing, the skills and educational requirements, etc. So, this prompt instructs Copilot to generate a one-page resume of a highly qualified candidate with work experience from fictitious companies. Study the resume and you can ask Copilot to make any required adjustments. You can also click the download button, then export it to Word for further iterations and modifications, or you can export it straight to PDF and save it for reference. At this point, you've identified your dream job and have a clear idea of the requirements you'd need to meet to qualify, but there's more. You now need a practical and comprehensive study roadmap to help you organize your time and get started on your skilling journey. Copilot, knowing what your goal is, is the perfect tool to help you generate this in a matter of seconds. Grab the provided prompt and modify by adding details that will help personalize the roadmap. 
with considerations for your timelines and study preferences. For example, do you prefer studying early in the morning or late into the night? Do you have a preference on audio over video and written materials, etc.? You may be thinking, I like what I see. I think it's a good start, but it's a bit much and hard to comprehend in this format. So, why don't you ask Copilot to rewrite it in a table format instead? I'm honestly impressed thinking about how relevant this roadmap is to the user's personal preferences and career goals. It would have easily taken hours to put all this together from scratch. As usual, take some time to go through the response and feel free to adjust accordingly. Remember, this is all AI-generated content, so ensure you take some time to validate this information especially any references to study materials. For an editable version of this roadmap, you can click this button right here and export it to Excel, then edit as you see fit. So far in the tutorial, with a dream job in mind, you used Microsoft Copilot to research more about the career, generate a resume for a qualified candidate, and create a personalized roadmap to upskill in readiness for your dream job. Part two of this tutorial assumes you have fulfilled the requirements in your roadmap and are now feeling confident to put yourself out there for opportunities. You'll focus on how you can clearly present yourself as a professional, communicating your skills, ambitions, and qualifications. In this section, Microsoft Copilot will help you generate a personal elevator pitch and conduct a mock interview. If you've not heard about an elevator pitch before, Imagine you got into an elevator with a potential hiring manager and you only have until the elevator reaches the topmost floor to introduce yourself and your professional qualifications. You basically have 45 to 60 seconds max to get them interested and consider you for an interview. And no, you don't want to spend 20 seconds thinking about what to say or saying things that don't matter at all. So. Paste in the provided prompt into Microsoft Copilot, which will generate a professional pitch that demonstrates your readiness and qualifications. And hey, don't take this as it is and start crowning it. Be sure to customize it to match your experiences, qualifications, and ask. Then master it to always be prepared to pitch yourself. The last thing we'll do is familiarize ourselves with the interview requirements and process for a job you hope to have one day. Just as we did before, we'll use the role setting technique to have Microsoft Copilot assume the role of an interviewer. Additional instructions include having Copilot ask relevant interview questions and provide feedback to the interviewee on how they can improve. At this point, Copilot will act as the interviewer and a mentor to help you improve and feel more confident while responding to interview questions. Let's try this and provide a written response to the first question. Take some time to draft a response to the question, and after you send it in, Copilot breaks it down further and includes some tips and suggestions on how you can improve your responses. Pretty cool, right? Oh, and by the way, you're not limited to just written responses. You can have Copilot read the question out loud and help you with your listening skills. Then, verbalize your response to the question. Let's see this in action. Great. Here's your next question. Question. How would you approach designing a scalable and secure architecture for a web application that needs to handle variable traffic loads? Take your time to respond, and I'll provide feedback on your answer. Um, I think I'm ready now. To design a scalable and secure architecture for a web application to handle millions of users, I would use a cloud-based infrastructure with auto-scaling to adjust the server numbers based on demand and use load balancers to distribute traffic. I would also employ a content delivery network to ensure 
low latency, and high availability. To secure the application, I would implement HTTPS and firewalls and the principle of least privilege for access management. Lastly, I would use managed database services to help ensure data integrity and performance under fluctuating loads and implement regular monitoring and logging to quickly address security issues or performance bottlenecks. Great response. Here's some feedback. Strengths. Scalability. Mentioning auto-scaling and load balancers shows you understand how to handle variable traffic loads. Security, including HTTPS, WAFs, and the principle of least privilege demonstrates a solid grasp of security best practices. Overall, your answer is comprehensive and well-structured. Keep refining these points to make your responses even more impactful. Would you like to try another question? Remember, if you're not satisfied with the suggestions from co-pilots, you can always iterate on the prompt to improve the response or regenerate a new suggestion. Congratulations, you've reached the end of this tutorial and have learned how you can use Microsoft Copilot as a student to prepare for your career. Wishing you the very best.